I turned off my nephew's PlayStation and you won't believe what he did. I'm 24 years old and have a nephew who is 10. He loves to play Call of Duty on his PlayStation 5. One evening I was babysitting for my brother. My nephew is usually a really good boy but sometimes he has his moments of rage. My brother told me my nephew is only allowed to play on his PlayStation for two hours, but then he would have to shut it off and do some homework. I spoke to my nephew and we agreed that after two hours of being on the game he was going to turn it off and do his homework. Well, two hours turned into four hours and that turned into six hours. Next thing I know it's one in the morning and he's still playing on the PlayStation. I told him he needed to shut that game off because his dad didn't want him playing for that long. But my nephew wasn't having any of it. I called his father who told me to just unplug the console. I considered doing that, but figured it would upset my nephew. So, I tried talking him into turning off the game and doing his homework. I tried to bribe him with food, money, and a new game for his console, but nothing worked. He just wanted to play Call of Duty. So, he left me no choice. I walked over to the television and unplugged the entire system. My nephew was so mad. He started raging and throwing things at me. He ended up throwing this glass face at my head which cut my forehead and lip. When the glass hit my head it broke and all this ash came out of it. Then I realized, the vase my nephew threw at my head contained his dead mother's ashes. Right at that moment my brother came in through the door. I told him exactly what happened and he took my nephew into the room. I could hear them fighting and hitting each other. I simply took my bag and left. I didn't even bother cleaning up the ashes from the floor.